All right, this video we're going to cover the older impact, the uh, MK1, MK2, to ensure you have the proper parts so you get the maximum velocity. Let me explain you the pieces here. You see a slide bar here? This consider the older MK1, MK2, that is here to here is 18 millimeter long all right to comp have more compression for the hammer spring you need this shorter because when this bottoms out you can no longer compress the hammer spring and this is the newer spring hole adjuster hammer spring adjuster the same as this but this is 16 mil long so you have at least two, three, three millimeter more compression on the hammer spring. That's it. All right. The next one, this is your older style hammer spring holder. All right. If you're gonna utilize this shorter slide bar, all right? This slide bar is, is attached to this. If you're going to compress hammer spring more, you're going to hit, let's say, this upper shear. If you have the older style, if you put a 16 mil here, 16 mil slide bar, without modifying this, or having the latest one, you will hit the slide bar you will bottom out and hit this slide bar i mean the upper shear instead of hitting here and bottoming out to get the maximum compression so to minimize that from hitting it the newer one has a a, a slot cut off all right so it will able the slide bar to compress hammer spring more without actually hitting the upper shear and actually bottoming out on the action here all right if you don't have these two upgraded parts the 16 mil uh, hammer spring adjuster and the hammer spring holder you're not going to get your maximum velocity even though you put on the, the fx power plenum on there you're not going to get the maximum velocity unless these two pieces are upgraded also all right the next video all right we're going to cover the hammer spring the new generation of power plenum they use utilize the 52 mil hammer spring the older style is 57. you could use either one of them but there's a limitation they have their own limitation all right 52 you get your maximum speed and you have more speed variation between max and minimum now, if you use a longer spring on a power plenum, uh, you don't get that much uh, speed variation, but you, you still get your power, right? So, uh, if you get the older style, I'll get, I would uh, recommend using the 52. You still get the maximum speed out of the gun, with, you know, with less vibration and easier to cock. <clears throat> also, if you are going to change your spring holder, it's called the C8 19609. We'll have all the latest. They'll have all the latest one with the cutoff, right? And your hammer spring adjuster, C10 19602, the 16 mil one. They don't have the. They don't. We don't have any more of the 18 mil. So it's all current models. If you want your maximum velocity performance on your mk1 mk2 that doesn't have these parts i would suggest replacing them